Social media is an excellent investigative tool. Social media is an excellent community outreach tool. Social media is an excellent professional networking tool. Social media can end your career with one post made in poor judgment. Social media is an excellent investigative tool. Social media can be used to post the details of an incident you are investigating and the general public can contact you directly or comment with tips or the identity of the suspects on your initial post. Social media can shame suspects or put fear into them that the police are actively looking for them. They will call the police department to try to gather information about the investigation or even just come to the police department and turn themselves in. Social media accounts are great for outreach tool for police departments. Police departments can advertise DUI checkpoints and child safety seat installation clinics, advise citizens of road shutdowns due to weather or construction, or help celebrate different community events. Social media is an excellent way to network with other professionals. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and other social media platforms can help you connect to friends, family, and coworkers from your department, those you met at the police academy, or other training events. Social media platforms can help you connect to colleagues. LinkedIn is a unique social media platform that focuses on connecting professionals of the same discipline and professionals of related disciplines. Social media can end a career in policing or other profession with one post on a platform made in poor judgment. This could be an inside joke between friends that an outsider misunderstands, a repost of a funny meme that may be found offensive, or a post that should not be made. There is a conversation that public service professionals have that, as a public servant, waived their First Amendment rights. Someone is out there looking to make a point by reporting a post, a meme, or an opinion that the reporting party does not agree with, whether the person who posted it was on or off duty. If there is an opportunity that you believe a post you have written but not yet hit send may offend somebody, just don't send it. Please do not send out these. Skip past them and scroll on to the next post. Do not post anything while on duty on your personal accounts. Do not use your social media accounts or cell phone personal cell phone for work-related activities by calling a suspect or a witness for an interview. This week we will focus on the pros and cons of social media in our written work. In the discussion post, find an article or a video that describes an incident where a professional from any discipline improperly used their social media account. Summarize this incident and provide your opinion as to whether you think the outcome of the incident, the firing or suspension, was appropriate for the action taken? Do you think there should have been a harsher, less, or none action taken by this person's company? Why or why not? The videos provided this week discuss building your own LinkedIn account. Next week's homework is to turn in a screenshot and web address of the LinkedIn page you have set up based on the instructions presented this week. Create a LinkedIn page or strengthen the one you may already have. Take some time to look for professional groups like Police, Police One or even Goodwin University's LinkedIn page. If you have any questions, please contact your instructor.